ODU is ready for the birth of a new sport. The due date is January 22nd for ODU women's volleyball. That's the first game for the Monarch startup program. It's a new sport for the school, two years in the making. As a matter of fact, the first recruiting class actually started practicing in September of 2019. They have a newly renovated and beautiful ODU Volleyball Center. The roster has some serious international flavor, but also loads of local talent from the 757 because we got some talent here in volleyball. Head coach Fred Chow started this from the ground up with a lot of help. First question I had for him was why add volleyball? It's the most popular and growing women's sports in the country. So even though a lot of universities have had volleyball for a long time, it's still growing in the juniors level. Of course, that leads to the next question. Why is volleyball so popular? Societal implications of, of being on this type of team where you really have to lean on each other. There, you can't take the ball by yourself and score. You can imagine the challenge of recruiting for something that never existed before. Some loved the newness, but for others, it was a tough sell. You know, people wanted to say, well, what's the culture of the team? They want to be part of something and they want to come into something. They want to say, hey, I was a part of this. And that's where we had to say, look, you're not going to be part of anything. You have to be it. It seems everyone on the team now bought into this birth of ODU volleyball. That challenge has been accepted and, and the weight of that realiza realization is really demonstrated every day in practice. They have not taken a day off, a session off. I love this part from today's workout. They practiced what it was going to look like the first time they enter the arena for that first game. It's hard to know how good they're going to be, but coach knows one thing. So I know we're growing. I, you know, now this is the part where, <laughs> you know, you got to put your money where your mouth is. I love that. Good luck to them. That first game, January 22nd, is at home with George Mason. As a matter of fact, they have three home games in three days. Family and friends for the first two games open to a very limited number of fans in the public on the Sunday game against Delaware State.